Hi. Here is a psoriasis eczema video, and this one's going to cover pneumonia. Pneumonia is an inflammatory condition of the lungs. Uh, it's related to psoriasis and eczema because psoriasis and eczema is an inflammation or an inflammatory condition of the skin. And if you consume toxic foods, uh, like vinegar, that could cause our, uh, an autoimmune condition in your skin called psoriasis. And it can also cause an inflammation in your lungs called pneumonia. And last week, I had a week of pneumonia and I was reminded by how much pneumonia is a very serious condition where a thick phlegm coats the inside of your lungs and it restricts breathing and causes distress. Okay, I got I have a page of narrative here. PE, psoriasis eczema, pneumonia, and why it is related. Inflammatory skin conditions are caused by eating toxic foods your family heritage did not eat. And eating these toxic foods sometimes starts an inflammatory process that could affect any part of your body, not just your skin. When the lungs become inflamed, the illness is called pneumonia. Pneumonia is an inflammatory condition of the lungs affecting the microscopic air sacs. It is usually caused by infection with viruses or bacteria and less commonly other microorganisms certain drugs, and other conditions such as autoimmune conditions. See, so pneumonia has those different uh, causes, one of them being viruses, bacteria, microorganisms, certain drugs, and autoimmune conditions cause pneumonia. A thick phlegm coats the inside of each lung restricting breathing and causing distress. Pneumonia has several possible causes and autoimmunity inflammation is one of those. If you eat toxic foods that cause inflammation, you could get a case of pneumonia from that. And pneumonia is a very serious illness with 450 million affected worldwide. That's 450 million people are affected worldwide with pneumonia and it ends up killing 4 million people worldwide each year so it's nothing to play with uh, for example vinegar is a toxin that is metabolized in some individuals producing inflammation and the, the organs that could get inflammation from that vinegar are the kidneys, your back, your spine, uh, your liver can be affected, uh, just like your skin does, and the lungs. And when the lungs are affected, it's called pneumonia. Vinegar is a toxic uh, <clears throat> food. Since psoriasis is an autoimmune inflammatory condition in response to eating toxic foods, so when you consume these foods, it can increase your risk of getting pneumonia. This relationship of eating toxin, toxins and health implications should be understood. When a person who has an autoimmune condition like psoriasis the serious illness of pneumonia might be caused by the same mechanism of eating toxic foods. Uh, this is another important reason to eliminate those toxic foods from your diet forever. I hope you achieve the beautiful clear skin you need and want while avoiding the serious illness of pneumonia. Good luck. All right three foods to avoid on this video. Vinegar. Vinegar is a toxin. Vinegar causes pneumonia. Alright. 
fermented beverages, especially the distilled type, which are a concentrated and often aged in uh, like a vinegars are, and those are full of toxins. All right. Last but not least, fermented foods like pickles, olives, beets, some peppers are, I believe, are pickled. But just beware, this pickled juice is vinegar, and that vinegar is a toxin. Okay, pneumonia. Yeah, I get about a minute left. It. Pneumonia is a serious condition should not be uh, overlooked uh, is the fact that toxins cause pneumonia. Toxins get into your body and an inflammation gets set up and one of the end results is pneumonia and some people it actually kills them so just keep that in mind the next time you get a, a bad case of like a bad chest cold and you think that it might be pneumonia and you suffer from autoimmune conditions like psoriasis, well, make that connection and hopefully you can avoid that condition in the future. Alright, have a good one. Bye.